to part 18 on our series on how to use Radio Boss automation software. My name is James. We're continuing our mini series on how to use the playlist generator in Radio Boss. And this video will tell us how to create audio categories in the playlist generator of Radio Boss. So first of all, we'll look at what is a music category and simply how to create one. So a music category, what is it? Well, your music library has a whole lot of music, but it's not just one great big type of music. Your music library can be divided into types of music. Th these are called categories. Sometimes they're called genres. These categories can control the sound and the feel of your radio station. Some examples of song categories, well, uh, current hits, golden oldies, we've got uh, songs in English, perhaps uh, traditional music that comes from uh, your parts of the world, maybe even gospel music as well. There are many other types of song categories, of course, otherwise known as genres. So how do I create a category in the playlist generator of Radio Boss. To do that, we've simply got to start in the music library. Perhaps you'll recall in an earlier video when I said how we need to make sure that all of the ID tags of the songs are filled, especially uh, for this exercise, the genre tag of each song. Come with me into the uh, the music library of Radio Boss. We'll open our music library up. WSR Music Library, that's us. Thank you. You'll notice here, in this column here, let me make this bigger for you so you can see, under genre, we have the genres there. They're all correct. That's fine. However, for the playlist generator to work properly, all of the genre information must also be in the comment field. Here it is here. You may remember that it is possible to move information or change information in your song tags one at a time or bulk many songs at a time. We're going to do a bulk change now. Come with me, let's have a look. All of the songs with the JG genre, that's uh, jazz gold, or old jazz songs, we're going to highlight, because we're going to add that information from the genre field to the comment field. As you can see, these are all the JG songs. Next, I right-click and go to Track Properties. This is the Tag Editor. And under comment, because it's in the comment field that I want to change, I type JG and push OK. This may take uh, a little while to do. There, it's all done, and if we scroll up, you'll see that all of the genre information has now been exported across into the comment field. Of course, any change you make in the music library, you've got to save. So let's go up to the top here and click the Save button. That's fine, that's done. Let's uh, leave the music library for now. Time now to move into the playlist generator. We'll just open it up. There we are. We are going to create our first category. It's going to be a music category. 
Come down here to the bottom, you'll see three buttons here, a plus, a minus, and an edit. We're going to push the plus key, and a box will come up called Category Params. We stay in the General tab. First of all, let's give our music category a name. And this one is going to be called Jazz Gold. Come down a little bit to this uh, heading here that says Duration. I suggest so strongly that we choose just one track. So we choose the, the top option. And this part here, um, do not tick this, the ignore here. For, for a music category, do not tick this. All right, now we've given the, the music category a name. Let's now go and tell it where the music is. So look at the uh, tracks tab here. First of all, we're going to go into the music library. And we're going to navigate to the music library, desktop, Radio Station, Radio Boss, Music Library, WSR. There we have it. And open. That's correct. So we've told it, we've told Radio Boss that all the songs are in the Music Library, but we just haven't told it yet which songs from the Music Library are going to be Jazz Gold. So we're going to do that next. By the way, come down at the bottom here, Tracks Selection. I have chosen random. Leave that at uh, random for now. On to the filters tab. This is where we tell Radio Boss where to find the jazz gold. You see under the heading comment, come down to this box here, you are going to have to type this word require. Then space, and because the um, the category in the comment field is JG. That was our code, JG, like that. Let me do that one more time for you. So, R E Q U I R E space J G. And that's all done. And here we have our Jazz Gold category, our first one. Now, I'm going to go and get another audio category, but this time we're going to do a non-music one. Let's do, I know, Station IDs. So again, let's go down to the bottom here, hit the plus key, category name, I'm just going to call it ID. Again, duration one. This time, I am going to click this top box here, which says ignore, do not repeat options. So for things like station IDs or voice track markers, click this box here. Tracks, this time we're not going to go to the music library, we're going to go to a folder. So let's navigate to the folder where the station IDs are. Radio station, audio, IDs. There we have it. And I'm quite happy for these to play in order. And there are no filters required. So there we have two audio categories. One is a music one and one is a non-music one. Now what we've got to do is that we've got to save this and we save it as a preset. Come with me to the top of the screen here, you'll see the word preset. Now we need to push the save button and it says enter preset name and I'm going to call this WSR for Wandering Sheep Radio Master and OK. And there it is saved up here. 
So later on you can come to this drop box and choose this from a series of options. In the next video I'll explain a little bit more about this and we'll go into this in quite a bit more uh, depth and detail. But perhaps there's one question on your mind and you're going to ask me, James that's great, uh, thank you very much, but I have a song that I put into the jazz category but actually I think it's more worship. How do I tell Playlist Generator that I've moved the song from one category to another? It's quite simple. It is not done in Playlist Generator. It is done in the music library. Go into the music library, find the song that you want to change, and simply change the genre and the comment, and it's done. Complete. Hope that you enjoyed this video on how to create a category in the playlist generator of Radio Boss. In our next video, we're going to look at how to create a playlist structure. Do join me for that here on How to Use Radio Boss.